sending images in your email signature is really quite easy. Hey, it's Jaime with Echo Real Estate Advisors. Today we're going to cover how to add an image to our Lion Desk email drip campaign and our email signature. So a, mo a common misconception is all you need to do is download an image or upload an image into your computer, copy and paste it over, and you're off and running. Or download an image from the internet that could be a picture of, of a house, it could be a picture, of, it could be your own picture, or anything else that you want to embed into your email signature or emails and there's that frustration whenever you do the control C and then go over to Lion Desk and do the control V which is control paste and it doesn't work so know that that is not gonna work as you, I, I may not be telling you anything new since um, there's a reason you may be watching this video but know that with Lion Desk it doesn't work that way the way that we're going to the way that we're going to upload something an image into our email signature is uh twofold. So there's one step that you need to complete before you can actually link up or have an image be displayed on your email signature or your email. So let's just jump into it. This is my profile settings with Lion Desk. And this is going to look very similar to something you already have. And if you don't have Lion Desk, there's um, there's uh, there's a link in the description below, so feel free to use it. Here is my email signature. Now, this image, when you when you click on it, this is a live image. Whenever you click on it, it's going to go over to my to my website. So that is what your customer, that's what your client, that is what your vendor, that's what the outside world sees. Now, when you edit the image, you're going to see that there's a link up here. And this URL, before you go off and buy a domain or get a, a new website or anything else just to host the image, know that this URL is provided by LionDesk. That's that first part that we need to go and accomplish. So, but there's no going and buying domains. There's no having to create a website. Even if you don't have a website, this is going to work. This is part of the Lion Desk ecosystem. I just want to show you what it looks like. And then the link of where you want people to go to whenever they click on it is totally up to you, but that this is where you would do that. The image info is going to show a URL. You could put alternate text, whatever, um, whatever you want there. I just... I was not creative. I just put logo. It should actually be headshot, but let me change it. Okay. And then the width and the height. And we'll we'll do that here in a few seconds. All right. Okay, so that's what it looks like. Let's go over. Let me save what I did here. Let's go over and actually create this digital asset, which is essentially what we're doing, and, and get working. All right, you're gonna go to Documents. If you don't have a folder, the images, I believe, will be there by default. So you don't need, you don't need to create a folder if you don't like to. I do just to stay organized. So I would create an, a folder here, and um, but that's totally up to you. However, you want to be organized. This is where this is where I have some images, and what I am going to do at this point is select which folder I want to upload this an image into. So I'm going to select high mirror ascendant slash head headshot, and I'm going to just upload this. It's going to look like it didn't go through, but it actually did. You're going to see up here that nothing happened, but when you click over here, there's what you just uploaded. Now, the reason we're doing this is that URL that you saw a few seconds earlier, that's what's important to us. You're going to go to attach, I'm sorry, you're going to click on it. 
And this is the URL that you saw a few seconds ago. This is what's important to us. We're going to copy and paste that, so Control C. We're going to go back to our profile. And we're going to edit our email signature. Now, you're not just going to control and paste here because what happens is it just shows you the link. That does us no value. That This is certainly not an image. What you're going to do at this point is, let me space down just so you see the differences. You're going to go over here where it has the image icon. You're going to click it here and note where just, uh, you, you can hardly see it, but my my cursor is right here. Wherever your cursor is at, this is where the image is going to show. And I may not be telling you something that's new, but um, just know that that's what it is. Go over here to your image. You're going to control paste. This is the URL that you just created over in the document section. Again, a common misconception or where we go wrong is you just Download an image from the internet that you think is going to be very valuable to include into your either your email signature or into your email drip campaign and you do the upload and it just doesn't work. So this is how you do it. First you need to go over to documents and create your URL so it's hosted within LionDesk and then what you're doing here is assigning that image and linking up the image to where it actually populates. And then I'm just going to put test logo here. You see here that it's a large image. It's 2200 pixels by 800. Now let's bring it back to something a little bit more modest. That's still fairly large. 150, that looks kind of okay. And notice how the height is adjusting. So that's where you want, that's what you want. You want the, the dimensions and the proportions to stay to stay the same. And there's our image. So it's not it's not too bad. I can type after it. This is the test logo for blah blah blah. You can type all around it. So if you were gonna send an email or if you're gonna put an e an image like you see here on my on my signature, this is what you this is what you would need to do. Copy and paste will not work. You're going to be frustrated beyond belief. Know that the first step in the process is going over to the documents and uploading your image. Going over here and uploading your image. Select a folder you want it to go into, then drop your file in there. And what's more important to you, what's really the most important part to you is when you click on it, you get the URL, which is what makes everything run at the end of the day. So that's how you add an image to Blind Desk and feel free to add it to your email signature, any emails that you send, any drip campaigns that you're, that you're sending. If there's any questions, comments, or concerns, please feel free to drop them in the comment section below. There's other videos about Blind Desk throughout the channel, so feel free to subscribe. And there's constantly, there's constantly videos being uploaded every week. So I'll see you in the next video.